Welcome back, people. We're playing more Space Haven Alpha 10, and uh, well, we're just doing this settlement for getting the two guests back to the sla not slavers, the Android Collective, and we got a settlement for it, and we're doing a trade. So we're gonna knock that out. Might as well mine that while we're at it, which we are. Ship's coming together pretty good, I would say. This guy is composting stuff. Good. Hmm. I may have this here temporarily and turn it off and put one out here since I don't have any refugees now. So let's uh, turn that off and let them use all this stuff. Uh, let's see. Where is that? There we go. Edit. Permissions. Clear refugee area. There we go. Problem solved. I'll even let them use those beds for now. Just as a backup. Done. Cool. Alright, the trade and settlement's still going on. Getting some money. We're getting some hyperfuel. Looking forward to that. We are researching a medical bed, which is something we need. Because yeah, it could get real bad real fast. Let's see, I forgot to update my spreadsheet here with, uh, what was my new character's name? Is that Rainbow Chutney? I believe it was. Let's see. That was Rainbow Chutney. You are a wimp. Okay, let me add that for trait. I find when you get a ridiculous amount of crew members, this really matters. Uh, did I update their priorities? I did. I did. We're good there. Cool. Ugh, somebody barfed all over. Is it because they ate this? Jeez, I think we're doing good on food. Maybe, maybe not. This says otherwise. Really need to get some extra food production going. Oh, bad temperature. What? It's too hot. Too hot for teacher. Okay, so I think I'm gonna put one right there. Yep. We'll cram that in. Uh, life support, thermal regulator, and right there. Nice. Then at least keep this going. So, somebody gave me a good tip. Uh, let me, let me find it somewhere in here. I gotta look at my channel comments. Oh, IHTFP01, P01, said I should, uh, go for a one-way node here. Just to make sure this always has power. And I, I agree. So let's fix that. Let's change that into a one way in. So that way there's power trickling in from both sides. And that should make sure this has power for a little while. And this won't be trickling out. So we'll try that for a bit. I kind of want this trickling into the rest of the uh, network. But we'll try this for a bit. Make sure this is good to go. We're good on temperature now in here. There we go. Optimal temperature. Yeah, previous failed. That is a shame. Okay, so these ones were good because they were close to this one. These ones failed. Well, one of them failed because it was too hot over here. Too spicy. It's really hot right here. Well, I'm going to have to fix that. I'm going to put one in here. I guess this is just a really hot... Yeah, a lot of thermal radi radiation. How are we doing? Are we, uh... We're just about done. Cool. Let's get out of here. Listen to some sweet tunes from Paul Zimmerman. While I enjoy my morning coffee on a morning that I woke up way too early on yet again. Because I'm a morning person. Alright, so I want to come up here, hit this, or did I want to get this? I can't remember if I got this already. I was chasing these guys. Oh, there's another android ship. Hmm. Well, let's go check this, because I've got excess uh, energy, pretty much. I'm going to make sure I've cleared this bad boy. I know there's a way to see it. Oh! Oh my. <laughs> We're going to come up here and camp out in this sector for a wee bit. 
Yeah. Man, I really can't wait until crew members you find out there or recruit or prisoners or refugees you get have a chance of being infested by bugs. Oh my God. That's gonna add so much tension to every interaction or everybody's just gonna space everybody. But again, that's up to your play style. Do you wanna play it super safe or do you wanna play it kind of fun and enjoyable? I don't know. I'm not you, I wouldn't know. All right, we're gonna let these guys rest up for a little bit while we mine. And then once they're all nice and cozy, we're gonna send them out to go shoot things in the face. Because that's what you do in space. All right, it looks like my away team is pretty much good to go. Oh, well, maybe not. Pal, you can uh, chill out for a bit. I've started putting some doors in to isolate these spaces a little bit. That might be affecting some of the temperature issues, maybe. Uh, I'm gonna start, you know, adding the creature comforts to this. A couple of the U-shaped ones, it's gonna be cool. Gonna like it. My folks are gonna be able to chill out, put a little light right there. Man, ships are fun. All right, we got a two-man away team. Not the best choice I could make, but it is a choice that I am making. It is a decision that much is absolute. And here comes the lucky 13. I do have an extra pistol on board. To figure out what to do with that. I've got an extra hull block from scrapping. Cool. I could theoretically move this back. Just to give myself a little more space here in this corridor. Huh. I'm gonna have to think about that for a little bit. First, we gotta deal with this with our small two-man crew. Smoke them! Shoot them! Oh my god, that was a bad start. Jeez, come on, fellas. Okay, push. Push. Oh, girl's almost down. Pull back. Pull back. Retreat. Retreat. Don't go down, Ungarl. All right, we're going to have to come back to this in a minute. <laughs> Let's undraft you and send you back. Oh, Ungarl got smoked. It's because he wasn't firing right away. Come on, man. What are you doing? What you doing? Basically, the shotgun chef again. Dude's a cook. I'm looking forward to the point where you can have a dedicated profession to just cooking. Like a chef for the ship. A ship chef. In the mess hall. Like, I think that'd be cool. I think that's kind of where they're going. I mean, they've got cook as a previous profession. I feel like that should uh, apply. Yeah, probably be a big part of the gameplay for uh, space stations when you can do those. If you think about it. It would make sense anyways. Uh, how am I doing on mass? Pretty good. Let's start building out more of our ship. Let's activate some of this. I'm gonna go to here. We'll see what we get. And then I'll start building out the, uh, food production. Essentially double our food. That'll be good. I may do more up here too. So I'm not gonna need all this space for this. But this will be good, a good start on our food production. What's not on the grid? You, of course you are. What if I move you here? Will that put you on the grid? I bet it will. Or maybe not. Nope, I think this middle piece is... Okay, we're good there. Strange. Very strange. Uh, can I put anything in there yet? I don't think so. So I could, uh, I guess, make another storage there. Huh. I did see on Solid Content's latest episode, actually in his previous one, he put in a second research lab. That's probably a good idea. It seems like it to me anyways. Are we about at the point where we can send out the dream team? I hope so. I really hope so. All right, good. They're resting. Need to get you guys some real food. Yeah, look at that. Got some good lighting over here. How's the comfort? 
Oh man, it's plus one. Nice. Very nice. Uh, I probably need to move this because it's not really covering what I wanted to cover. Hmm. We'll see. I guess they want to sleep out here for now. All right, you guys are good enough. I'm going to leave Oliver behind on this one. Yeah, yeah, I know. Ungaral, shotgun, chef. You got to go out again. That's fine. You'll be fine. You already smoked most of these bugs. There's probably one hanging out right by the airlock, though, so... Got to be a little careful. Maybe not. Oh, there he is. You sneaky little bug. One girl's just tanking like a champ. Let's kick open that airlock door. Okay, we're clear. Let's keep moving. Oh, there's a bug. Pull back. Smoke him. Alright, I need you to pull back there, one girl. One more down. No! Now I need you to push. You gotta take point on this. I'm gonna have to send uh, Ungarl back. Yeah, Ungarl, you gotta get on board. Go. Get out of here. Alright, well this side of the ship is clear, so I'm gonna come over here and try to take pot shots of these bugs. Let's go ahead and undraft you. Uh, come on, bug. You being smart? You getting smart with me, bugs? Come on. Oh, there you go. Smoke him. All right, we're gonna get our hands on some, our feet on some nice solid metal there. Some solid content. <laughs> All right, out we go. That hallway's clear. We got a bug. Smoke him, please. There you go. What do we got? What do we got? Anything? Nothing. Timberline Drive. Okay. Well, let's pull all the stuff off here. A uh, pretty good haul. Yep, I'll take all that. And we'll take these. What are we doing on whole scrap? Pretty good. I'll take some soft scrap while I'm at it. In from good on. Yeah, I think we're good. Start working on that. We've only got a little bit more to pull down here. Well, actually, this will take a bit, but we're doing pretty good. All right, I'm going to let these guys do their thing. Hopefully not die on me, and I'll come back to you guys in a minute. Well, the android ships have just jumped in. One's scanning me. They're suspicious. Why? I gave you your dudes. I ain't got nothing. I ain't got no time for that jibba jabba. What do you guys have? You got an assault rifle. Uh, could be good. Could be good to have, because the shotguns are a little nerfed. Uh, what do you want? What could I sell you? Could I trade you a pistol for an AR? <laughs> Not quite. I'd have to pay something out of pocket, but that's fine. Um, hmm. I could sell off two of these, because I got a little excess. Let's do that. I'll buy that assault rifle from you, androids. Why, thank you. Improve our relationship a little bit while we're at it. I, mean, I feel like I gotta keep Ungarl as the shotgun chef. I mean, that's such a good name. It rolls off the tongue. So I will change the flooring in here as soon as I fix this. I'm trying to think, like, I kind of want, like, the bathroom area right here. Put, like, a toilet, a toilet. Maybe make these into individual rooms, going back just a little bit more, and then make all this, like, food production and stuff. I think that could work. Just really get some food production going on this ship. <laughs> and turn this into, like, energy and shields, probably. So another, another one of these bad boys. A little solar panel array. That's our first uh, above board component, actually. Interesting. I really need shields, as we saw in that one system where it was just nonstop micrometeoroids and stuff chasing me around the system. That was crazy. Whew. Still suspicious of me. Why, why would you think, why would you be suspicious? 
I've done nothing wrong. I'm authorized to be here. <clears throat> We're gonna try to hail them. Let's try to negotiate permission to visit. Oh, look at that. Hey, Stargazer, it's fine, man. Sure, no? How about, how about again? What if I ask you again? Come on, you know you want to. No? How about one more time? Ah, oh, there we go. Fourth time's a charm. All right, that's it. Just wanted to look at your ship. I mean, you can see mine too. I don't get. I don't I ain't got none of your people. <clears throat> so it looks like the way this one's set up is bridge, bridge, which has like the weapons console and the nav console, and then you, or maybe that's the nav. I think that's shields. That's comms or operations, and that's nav. Interesting that it's split. You got co like. Oh, interesting. It's like a combined bathroom. I bet the comfort's not great there. Yeah, it's not great there. It's comfy in here, kind of. It's more neutralized, so I guess it's not comfy. This is not a comfy ship. Not at all. Uh, how about you guys? Are you still suspicious, too? Great. Uh, what can I buy? Let's buy water. I'll buy water, and I'll sell you some infra blocks, because I have a bunch. I don't want to get rid of them. There we go. Slowly improving them relations. All right, cool. We just got a little bit more to do. Strip this thing down. And I'll come back to you in a minute. Okay, well, we're still mining, but now I can get some food production in here because I built more of my hull out. So let's get this going. Awesome. Oh, look at all that food. So good. I may put another storage locker right here of the small variety, but we'll see. I'll spend a lot of whole blocks on this. I mean, uh, infra blocks rather. All right, well, what we're gonna do. Oh, interesting. That's bringing the comfort up because it's got light. Oh. Interesting. I've never thought of it that way. Uh, let's go ahead and start picking our food. Let's get out of that overlay. I'm going to start with some fruits. One each. Just go continuous. And let's get this guy for veggies. Great. There's no power. How do I want to do power? I need a hallway, really. But for now, I can do some in-floor power nodes just to get me covered. That'll do. See how this goes. So I've already done that. Let's do some artificial meats. Uh, let's get this going for nuts and seeds. Yeah. Nice. Hopefully that'll alleviate some of our food issues, at least for our crew members, and start building up a little bit of a stockpile of food. Need somebody to build this dumb thing. Let's look at the links. Yeah, it's still not built yet. I'll do another one way in, or I guess one way out for this guy. And that way the power just trickles into there. Or maybe you do a one way here. There we go. Problem solved. And staying solved. And no, still didn't get it. So let's start this over. We need fruits, I think, for the most part. Fruits are a good staple. Hey, we got the medical bed researched. Let's, um. What do we want to go for? Hmm. Well, power capacity node's probably good, but let's go for shields, actually. Let's get the shields console researched. I feel like I'm going to need that. Ooh, that's ready. Let's go with a two-way. It's all powered. Sort of. <laughs> it's trying to push some power to it. <clears throat> it. It sucked it all down.
All right, great. Everything's getting planted. We're going to slowly build this out and get another one of these bad boys up there. Solar panel action. Okay, well, we're almost done with mining, too, so we can get going here shortly. Exciting. Super exciting times. Okay, well, we're done. He just dropped off all the resources. We're going to go do another derelict. Smoke him if you got him, fellas. <laughs> I'm not going to bother with getting that noble metal because we got a good amount. I don't really use it for much. Because I'm a food truck, man. A food truck. I do food stuff. Trade the goods. Oh, that's a small one. Oh, well. We're going to send these three, the three amigos out. Get on board. Well, let's go ahead and dock. I guess the airlock. I mean, I bet I could dock here and then float my, my happy ass over here. But oh well. Out you go. Let's deal with this problem. Smoke them. Nice. Open that door, please. All right, we found a majority of the bugs. They're on the other side of the ship, which is cool for me. No, get back. Kill that one, please. Get that close one. Nice. Go ahead and take a knee. Look cooler, because that's most important, obviously. It's a little small ship, but that's, that's fine. Let's speed it up, because this is going to take a little bit. Oh, no. Oh, no. We got to go get that stuff. So I'm going to go ahead and take you off draft. Micrometeoroids are very bad. Is there anything we want to prioritize getting? Yeah, give me that and that. I'll take this too while I'm at it. Undraft you. I mainly want to get these because that's something that I can't just get anywhere. I really need to get the shields up and running. Okay. Boys, we got to go. I'm going to draft you. I'm going to dock you here. We're going to scoop everybody up. Oh, no. Get on board. Boys, we got to go. We gots to go. I don't want to lose my ship. Somebody's got to repair that quick. Okay. We're going to dock here. We're going to get ready to go because we got the important stuff. We got the money. We got the, uh, we got the goods. Somebody get on navigation, please. Or did they already go? Did we already lose the micrometeoroids? I think we did. That was a short-lived one. Okay. Never mind. Let's take everything and get on a dodge. I'll go ahead and get the Tekken Energy while I'm at it. Whew. That was a quick one. It just came in out of nowhere. I like it. I like that it's a more random chance for stuff to just come in and... Slap you around. <laughs> Alright, food's going okay. How's this doing? It's doing its thing. These are still producing. I think they were able to keep it up and running. It's really good. Oh, I did it a little different over here. That's ah, fine. It'll be fine. Did I leave that on? No, I didn't. We're good. A lot of stuff to do. Come on, guys. Get to work. Get your loggy stuff going on. All right, well, I'm going to strip this down, and I'll come back to you guys in a minute. After I build my medical bed. But you'll see that here shortly. All right, well, we've cleared that out. We've got a little bit more of this built out. Put two medical beds in here temperature regulator and a little storage to put all the IV fluids and medical supplies in here. I'm starting to set these rules up more for a fleet. <clears throat> more for a fleet rather than just one ship. Because I could just do a bring all here or bring here rule. But I'm going to do a minimum of 10. So set me up for the long term. 
I may put one cryo sleep chamber in here just to cover my bases. <laughs> Give me one for emergency use. Like if I can't feed somebody or I don't have any medical supplies, I can throw them in there so they can uh, go into stasis. I imagine that'd be good for when you get infested crew members and you can't fix them. Should be interesting. Let's get out of here. There we go. All right, we're gonna head back down here, try to clear out this space, and then we're gonna head down here to the Baron system. Exciting. Uh, we are here, we need to go down here. And there's a lot of androids here. Maybe it's just the two. But we're gonna get this ice real fast. Come in here, mine all this, check out that stuff. It'll be good to go. Dropping in. We need all the ice we can get. We're gonna be uh, consuming a lot of water. All right, you. What do we have? We've got fruits, meat, veggies, fruits. Uh, I'll get some more veggies. We'll do that. I'm going to mine this and I'll come back to you guys in a minute. Ooh, never mind. There's a, looks like a heat problem on this ship. It's fine over here, but it's killing my plants over here. Yikes. Yikes. That ain't good. There's only so much I can do. This area is really hot. Really spicy. Um... Uh, not much I can do right now. I guess I could throw in temporarily one of these big thermal regulators over in the corner here. Let's do that. Crap, lost all those. Because I don't have the walls here to deal with this. I guess that's one of the benefits of putting these on an interior space. There's, it's less affected by external environmental conditions. Space weather, as we'll call it. There we go. There we go. Temperature is regulated. It's actually getting kind of hot over here. But this is dealing with this room perfectly fine, so we should be good there. Everything else on the ship is doing really well temperature-wise. So I may eventually need to get another engine up and running, which means I would probably put it like right here in the middle. Put one of these engines over here, one over here. I think that's my plan. But we'll see. All right, mining's done. Let's get out of here before we cook to death. And away we go. It's a pretty juicy system right here. So we'll hit this. I'll go check this out. I'm, I'm probably not going to take it because I don't really have the crew to deal with all that. Oh, this is like a... This almost looks like an abandoned station rather than a ship. And it is. How cool. All right, team one, you guys are ready. We're going to take the Mustang of Lenny out this time instead of the lucky 13. And let's dock here with this airlock because that seems like a good idea to me. I'll look for survivors, get some get some goodies. Let's push in here. Nothing yet. Interesting. Pretty dead. Oh, there you are. Fire, please. Smoke them. Nice. Okay, let's get over here. There's like living quarters, it looks like. There's one coming up on the right. It's a very open space. Smoke that bug. In that bed, apparently. It's a hostile bed. He had a weapon. <laughs> pew pew and please. This guy. There you go. Nice. Oh, they're fighting, taking a long way around. This is great. It's like a shooting gallery. Great. Let's get to uh, clearing. Oh. What's all that? 
We'll go get that real fast. Send somebody after it. Scoop up the goodies. Looks like it's Umgar who's going to overshoot. <laughs> and his EVA. Come on, turn around. Turn around quicker. Have money. More money. And even more money. Nice. Speed things up a little bit. Kind of just floating around here. Oh, we got a hostile. Shoot him. Nice. There we go. We got the covenant. There's more stuff on here. Nice. All right, we got the credits and a new data log. Great. Let's undraft this shuttle. Let's take this guy. We're going to transfer what little is on this ship. Oh, there is some stuff. It's good. We got an energy block. Let's scrap all that. And call that good. Okay, well, we've got the Android Collective jumping in. We'll see what they have to trade. We're still mining stuff. We're out here scrapping things on here. Mostly just have to move things. There's the Bismarck again. Still suspicious of me. I'm not hiding nothing. I'm just hiding some delicious food here and some great deals <laughs> on the space food truck. Uh, eventually, I'm going to move this around, reshuffle things. Hmm. I'd like to clear this out of here. I'm fine with these algae dispensers being here for now because they're kind of saving my butt. This will uh, come back for me eventually, which is good. What do you guys have? You want to trade anything? You got water? I'll buy four of your water. Um, yeah, that'll do. I'll sell you something. <laughs> I don't know what. What do you guys really want? Eh, plastic. That makes sense for androids, I guess. Let's trade, um... Yeah, a couple of plastic. We'll make some money on this deal. Gain a little bit of standing with them. Cool. I'm gonna let this rip. Mine all this crap. Strip this thing down for what it's worth. I'll come back to you guys in a bit. All right, well, that's the last little bit of stuff off here. Uh, we're going to get moving out of this place. Wait on that shuttle to come back. Still need more hull blocks so we can really get this built out. Let's go check out this claimable derelict up here. We'll see what's on there at least. You never know. Well, it's fairly good size. That's a two by two. Man, that's surprising. Let's send a smaller away team. Go check it out. Send Ungarl and all of our doms. There we go. And we're going to dock right here. Interesting, the engine's intact. The rest of it is not. Out you go. A wide open ship. Hmm. Whole lot of nothing. Interesting. Let's go clear this room. Nothing back here. How about back here? Nothing and nothing. Okay, well, I'm gonna undraft this. What's on here? Anything juicy? So I'd claim or I could abandon it. If I claim it, I could get some stuff back that's useful. I guess like tech blocks and stuff. Eh, let's claim it. And then we'll go ahead and dismantle everything. If I remember right, I think I can dismantle stuff from here. Yeah, you can. You can just select it all. And I think that'll do. Yeah, that'll work. That'll get me started anyways. I'm going to go through and hit the delete key on these because that makes it way easier. <laughs> yeah, I'll take it. I'll tear all this apart and uh, I'll come back to you guys when it's done. Then we'll leave this thing behind. Well, I'm stripping this thing down. These guys jumped in, buying some water from them. Uh, this got finished, so that's cool. Let's, um, go to power. Let's get our solar panel built right there. Let's, uh, move this, I suppose, right here for now. And we'll build out our wall. Isolate this a little bit. Cool. Well, we've researched the shields console. That's really good for us. Let's, uh, get a shield generator then. 
It's going to take me a little bit, but that'll help out here. And we can get another... Well, and get a shield up and running so we don't get smoked by micrometeorites every time they fly in. Because now I can't really avoid them. They'll come after me. Trying to build out more of the hole here. Going back. So we have the hallway here done, the hallway here done. We can start worrying about the interior of the ship up in the front section. No tools. To, oh yeah, there's no none over here. That's fine. I've stripped everything down on here. We're pulling everything back. Getting whole blocks is really good. I forgot about that. Stripping down some of these facilities would have gotten us some uh, whole blocks. It's great. That's a big boon. All right, we're just about done. Let's get ready to jump. And we'll get moving. Out to the Baron system. I'm excited. All right, you're here. That's going to get left behind. Perfectly fine. We're going to jump. And we're going to jump down here. We're going to go check out this Baron system because I'm interested in this new location. Doesn't seem like hypersleep sickness is a thing yet. Eventually it will be. Then we got to worry. All right, we've dropped into the new system. This is about to get built. That's going to be great. This hallway is starting to get built out. Oh, let's jump. Oh, it's still on the other ship. That's interesting. Uh, okay, we're gonna get ready to go. Wait for somebody to hop on comms. There we go, and off we off we move. A little bit of carbon here. What do we have? So we got small system, small system, big one, small one, and then we'll come over here eventually after we clear this. So I guess we'll start over here. There's a merchant federation ship. Let's drop in over here, and we'll come over this way. We'll check out this little fringe system. I don't have shields, so I have no problem dropping in here and checking this out. Not yet. No shields yet. Soon. Soon we will. All right, let's drop in right there. No airlock. Oh, no, there it is. It's hiding back there. Team one. Time to go. get a pretty decent crew going because this is a fairly large ship. I'm a little worried about it. Might be a crew member on here too. Team one, let's get moving. I just had somebody to mine that carbon just because we do need carbon over time. That's how you scrub the air, I think, if I remember right. All right, let's rush. Check out this little room, nothing. Some goodies right there. I like that. Oh no, solar flare. Not cool. All right, we do have bugs. One right there, in fact. Oh, just blowing up tables, I guess. Let's get that money. And that data log. Oh, I didn't mean to click that. All right, so there's a lot of bugs on here, clearly. Oh my God. Smoke that one, please. Pull back. Nice. Nicely done, fellas. Oh no, Ungarl's down. That dude is a tank, but man, he goes down quick. He tanks a little too much. <laughs> too much frequency. Oh, pull back, pull back. Particularly you, Oliver. I need you to get back, back. Nice. Oliver, I want you to scoop up Ungarl and bring him back to the shuttle as long as you don't pass out with him. And Pal is going to go clear this by himself now. All by his lonesome. All right, that hole is clear. Let's clear the engine room and we're done. The soul striker. Does it strike its soul? Oh, that's a lot of food. Yeah, we'll take that for sure. Okay, you guys are good. We'll undraft the shuttle. I'll scoop you guys up, send you back. I think we'll be fine on a solar flare. We've got enough crew to be able to handle that stuff pretty quick. Um, I'm going to start deleting these because they're just taking up space now. 
a lot of logistics that needs to happen. We need to jack this in one way into here to feed that power. Awesome. And I may jack this into something else too. Like I'll probably do a power capacity node eventually, feed it into there and then feed that back into the system over here. Trickle in a little power, but we'll see. We've got a lot of work to do still. <laughs> Go ahead and build this wall while I'm at it. Yeah, we'll get to it eventually. It'll be fine. Hopefully somebody doesn't get stuck out there, because that does happen. All right, solar flare just hit. We got a fire in this hallway. Uh, that knocked out power to there, unfortunately. We're going to go ahead and close this vent. We're going to isolate this area. Turn you off. There we go. Isolate that area. We'll deal with it. This should be fine. Dylan's already working it. Cool. You get that power up and running before the crops get killed. Somebody repair this. Who can repair it real quick? Who's got this job? Matt, you're right there. Please fix that. That's a key node in the entire network. There we go. Please fix this. That is a priority. Let's look at our vents again, because I think we're fine there. Vents, turn you on. Open, open, open. Open that guy, that guy, and that guy. Oh man, we had plants die. Power shortages. That sucks. Oh well. Things happen. We'll be fine. We are getting a lot of food from this bad boy. Uh, I'm not too worried about scrap right now. Especially on medium. <laughs> I don't have to worry about it as much. Uh, this is just taking up space, so let's get rid of that. Build out the other comfy boy over here. Uh, let's look at furniture. Let's get a couch that goes to that edge. Boom. Let's get a table right there. We'll get a light right here. Nice. Nice. Ship's coming together. Really need to get a shield up and running. That's the key. Right, that mining's almost done. Waiting on stuff to get transferred over here because there's a lot of food that I want. And some whole blocks. Oh, nice. That'd be quite the boon for this. Let's get a nice little wall power node that goes one, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Apparently there's nothing there yet. <laughs> Odd. Why can't I build one there? Is that wall not built? I'm very confused. Huh. Weird. I guess we'll get that in a bit. Oh, we stripped this thing down as much as I really care to. Let's get moving. Got some of the walls here. I still can't build a power capacity node on here. Or not a power capacity node. A wall power node on this wall. So I may need to delete that wall and retry it. Or just reload the game eventually. That's my goal. Wait on somebody to get on nav. There we go. Thank you, Matt. Oh, there's a pirate. I haven't seen one of them in a while. We're going to go out here further explore a little further out here and then uh yeah we eventually have to come back through here so we'll deal with that in a minute but we'll mine this real fast maybe talk to the slavers guild we'll see drop in right here in the middle and i'm gonna go ahead and mine real fast starting to get there on the actual shield generator so we'll see all right, we're starting to get through this uh, Hyperium out here. I've done some remodeling, so I made these like individual rooms, sort of individual, dual bunk, but I've also moved the bathrooms right here. The two, the two lets. <laughs> so I moved them in here, put them in their own room. I think this will increase comfort levels a little bit out here. So I gotta get rid of this oxygen generator in this space. Cause I don't want anything out here. I want this to be a super comfy. Oh, so comfortable. <laughs> uh, I want that to cover most of this. Uh, so I could probably put 
Yeah, I don't really know. I could put another one of these here. Have tons of seating. Maybe. It provides a little bit of light. But we'll see. I'll eventually figure this out. I do like this idea. I'll put at least a room here, maybe another room here. I'll let some of these guys sleep out here if they really want to. Then we gotta get the kitchens in here so we can feed people. Feed the refuggies. <laughs> and then reduce the amount of people sleeping in here as, as much. We'll see. Things are going pretty good, I think. I've just noticed that I'm running low on Energium and starting to run low on energy rods. I may need to start buying them from people. Just to get my, uh, make sure I don't run out of power. <laughs> Cause right now it's an issue, clearly. Clearly a problem. You about done with that? Can you hurry it up out there, Matt? Probably gonna need to get moving because I need to go trade. So we might have a little conflict going on there. Oh, they're they're jumping. <laughs> I think we'll be good for a little bit on energy rods. I think we'll be fine. But we're gonna need to address that quicker. Sooner rather than later. Let's jump. I'm fine with leaving one of those behind. So I'm gonna get on nav. Thank you. Let's get out of here before stuff hits the fan. Oh, we can trade with the civilians, get some ice. I think that'll be good. Oh, that's a big civilian ship. So we're going to drop right next to him. We're going to get that ice. Yeah, this is the civilian ship with the guns. Sweet. What do you guys have? Oddly enough, this is cheaper. So we're going to buy as much of this as we can. Give us a little bit of a boost. We'll sell you one Hyperium, our hyperfuel. Uh, what else do you want? How about some uh, noble metal? That'll at least even us out a little bit. Cool. Man. That's pretty cool. How do you guys like me? Do you like me? Do you hate me? What's your stance on me? I think the civilians like me. Uh, yeah. Yeah, they're pretty good. Let's negotiate. Can I visit your ship? No? Oh, we try that again. Yeah, there we go. Now we can visit your ship. Not that we are. Share vision? Awesome. Let's take a look in their fancy pants ship yet again. Yeah, they've definitely got their crew covered for cryo sleep chambers. I know I call them something different every time. Hey, they did something similar. Cool. Yeah, I like this little setup. I was going to have it pass through so people can walk by, but I think I like this. Or I could put them back to back in the middle. Oh, Ooh, that could work. I like that. That gives me a pass through too. I'd have to get rid of this light. Let's do that. Can I do it here? Yeah. I like the back-to-back -back idea. Oh no. Oh no. Somebody get on that quick. This micrometeoroids came out of nowhere. Gotta fix that and we gotta go. Oh, my plants are dead. Man. Well, those come in, they go, like, pretty quick. Well, eventually we'll fix this. That's a damn shame. Ugh, I need people to get on repairs quick. Fix things up. A lot of things that are broke. At least they're gone. <laughs> that was rough. Oh, no, this got blowed up. Rebuild that, please. We're slowly getting there. Everything needs to be fixed. <laughs> Got too much stuff that's broken. And yeah, shields are a must. Especially since you can't avoid those now. They come in out of nowhere. Alright, power is fixed over there. It's gonna start trickling out to the rest of the ship. Man, that was a that was an unfortunate series of events. Getting back on fixing things. I don't remember what I had on this. Is this the veggies one? That is. Uh, it's probably fruit or something. What are we lacking? Everything. <laughs> We're always lacking everything. Yeah. Okay, so we need a little bit of everything. Got it. 
That's fruits. That's meats. So you can get the meat sweats. Uh, it's more fruits, more veggies. So I guess we need meat, probably. Let's do meat. Actually, let's do one nuts and seeds and one meat. Well, the ship's back up and running. It's good to go. Another priority on this. Everything needs to get fixed. How's this doing? Can't really select that. Oh, that's what needs to be fixed. Need our engineers to get out there and get things done. How's our O2 doing? It's catching up. We're okay. We'll be fine. Unfortunately, all of our plants died, so that's... Uh, yeah, that's why you need the shields to mitigate that. Because really, if you get a whole breach here, there's not much you can do. I mean, I could have closed these vents off, I guess. I don't know. There's no real good answer. Alright, let's move this. So I can have a nice little pass through so everybody working in this area can get around. Ah, right, cool. It's working pretty good. Is everything mined? Everything's traded? Good. Let's get out of Dodge. Try clear out this system and then uh, move on. Good goodbye, Lazarine. Off we go. We'll come up here and we'll mine this ice. Maybe trade with the Merchant Federation. See what's going on with them. That's a big ship. Let's drop in there. We'll get the ice. Let's trade with these guys. All the shields are gone for everybody. Uh, they've got seven of these bad boys. I'll buy them, because I got the money. I'll trade you a bunch of carbon, because I've got more than enough. Cool. How about you guys? Do you still have more? I'll buy some water from you. Maybe I should buy some whole blocks. Let's do that real fast. Let's buy five of those. I'll trade you... something. <laughs> I don't know what yet. How much hyper oh, I've got tons of that, so I'm gonna sell you some hyperfuel and make some good money. Cool. Nice. Well, we're gonna mine this, we're gonna do those trades, and then we'll get out of here. Hopefully we don't get micrometeorites coming in. Oh no, we got a solar flare coming in. Not cool, boy. Not cool, bro. Oh, we gotta get these trades done at least, and then we can get out of here, hopefully, before all this kicks off. Ooh. I need to build more of this hole out too. Oh, we're low on. Uh, we're not. We're fine on water. Maybe this got broken. Nope, still good. Okay. Well, that mining's almost done. Trades are almost done. We can get out of here before things get real bad. All right, shuttles are back. Everything's back. Let's get out of here before that solar flare comes in. Definitely added a lot of sense of urgency to this game. Oh no. Oh boy. Let's come down here. I'll see what happens. There we go. Getting a little sneaky with it. <laughs> We're gonna mine the uh, Hyperium. Get more of those crystals because they're good. And then we're gonna get moving. I did buy some whole blocks so we can activate more of the ship. Let's do that. Let's get the space ready for our shield generators. Let's do this. I could just go all in and build all that. Let's do it. Let's just build the entire thing out. We'll be done with that. Let's mine this. Nice. All right, we're gonna start building the walls out. Um, wall, let's go all the way down here. Cool. We got plenty of whole blocks. I think we'll be fine. I should have checked how much that was going to cost, but whatever. That's fine. Why are they in spacesuits? Huh. Little choice. <laughs> well, these guys have followed me in here. Uh, we're just going to get this and then get out of here. We got more of the hole being built out. Slowly filling it in with walls and stuff. 
I may bump this out of here so I have more space here, but we'll see. We'll see. What is it even supposed to look like? It's been a while. So I'll have a little bump out here. I'll probably throw the shield console here. We'll wall this off. Maybe put in another bed or two here and here and then make this all growing space. That sounds like a good idea to me. Might just use some of the big five bedders. Okay, we're done. Let's get moving. We'll head on back and then uh, probably call the episode there. Off we go. Stop and get this energy on because I need it real bad. All right, let's mine this. Maybe talk to those guys if that's a different ship. I don't think it is though. Yeah, it's a Bismarck. Ooh, 11, nice. It's quite the boon. All right, good, more of that's getting built out. Let's uh, wall this up while we're at it. There we go. At least this room will be nice and insulated. Oh, she got stuck out there. Not cool. Uh, how we doing? Still mining that. Still building things out. Waiting on our constructor to get to work. Who's that? It's Zach Edwards. Zach, are you a miner? Are you good at mining? Do you do anything good with mining? That's a low priority, but you're a two, so that's fine. At least you don't suck at it. Uh, let's build a door here. So that's my intent. Let's make this a pass through back to the workspace. So people can easily use the turret and come back. <laughs> there we go. Godspeed, Bismarck. Oh, uh, let's see. How are we doing? I need a wall here. This is coming together quite nicely. I'm going to build another wall here. And then we'll go here. We'll delete this so it kind of like offsets a little bit. Yeah. I'm liking it. Let's throw a door on this thing. I just throw a nice little comfy single bed in there, but we'll we'll start with the uh, double beds for now. The double beds. There we go. Let's throw a little light source in there. Mm. The good thing is, like, if I do this right, if I do a vent here and a vent here, that should feed CO2 into this space, and that should be good for plants. Yeah. I think that'll work. Oh, and then I got room to put like one of the two for beds, two for beds. Oh, this is going to be good. Maybe even a full big boy. I don't know. We'll see. Let's go with uh, furniture. Let's get a wall light right here. Let's do a little bit of temperature regulation. Where is it? Life support. There we go. Nice. I think that'll work. Cool. This is getting done. I'm liking it. This is almost done getting mined. That gave us a good boost to our Energium stockpiles, which is great. Oh, I could do another one of my comfy boys over here. Let's do that. Furniture. Let's get the big bad couch. Why does that seem off? No, it's fine. Nice, look at this thing come together. It's turning into like a proper ship. It's soon to be an actual food truck. Oh man, that is great. Let's build some more walls while we're at it. Slowly piecing this thing together while we're mining and we're done with mining. So let's get out of here. Sweet. Off we go. We're gonna come back here and go back to the Baron's main system. And I'll drop in here, come over here, drop into this system, and we'll mine this, and then I'll come back to you guys on the next episode.
But hey, thanks for joining me. And uh, hey, I appreciate all you subscribers. That's great. I won't beg for subscribers. I'm not going to be one of those guys that's like, oh, like, like, subscribe, and be sure to follow, and all that crap. Hey, if you're going to do it, you're going to do it. You're a, you're a sentient being. If you like my stuff, you'll do it. If you don't, hey, you won't do it. Whatever. But hey, thanks for joining me. I appreciate all you guys. Take it easy.